nine races on Sunday, the 21st of February at Hollywood Bets Scottsville up in the capital, Peter Maritzburg. Nine exciting races, some competitive racing, and the race meeting opens with a maiden juvenile plate over 1,000 metres at 12 o'clock noon, so at the top of the hour. Race one, Graham, small-ish field, just the nine runners going to post at this point in time. Interesting race, not too much form to work with. Very little form to work with. Uh, number six, Paris Ricks, who has been priced up the early favourite at even money from the Justin Snay stable. Anton Marcus, a significant booking. Did run fourth on debut. Beaten quite some way by Edgar Town. Now, Edgar Town, of course, is trained by Mike Miller. And you, part owner of number three, chief executive, is also trained by Mike Miller, making its debut, this two-year-old son of captain of all. And you were telling me off air that as things stand, as two-year-olds, chief executive is actually a lot quicker, more precocious than Edgar Town. And you guys are fairly confident of making a winning debut. Yes, Graham, indeed. That's number two, three, chief executive, the captain of all gelding. Lovely to have a share in him. And the word from the yard is very positive. He's uh, showing tremendous work. He's showing tremendous speed. And this team are expecting him to go very close to winning on debut. So I'm excited and I'm hoping for a winning performance. Well, he's healthy. Respect for him in the early stages of the market. He's been priced up 16 to 10, second favorite. So number six, Paris Ricks at even money. Number three, chief executive at 16 to 10. The only other two-year-old quoted in single figures is number one, Corda Beza, at seven to one. Uh, but as you say, there's very little form to work on. Number seven, Uncomplicated, showed very good speed on debut before fading away tamely to finish nearly 10 lengths behind Good Traveller. That was over 1,100 metres. He goes 100 metres shorter this time round, so he could improve to fill one of the back end of trifecta quartet placings. Uh, for the rest, uh, obviously, stable companion to number three, chief executive is number four, Song of Freedom. has got a nice pedigree, first time out by Karari, out of her daughter of Fordwood. But chief executive is, uh, by, to all intents and purposes, the stable elect. Certainly is, without a doubt, uh, is the stable elect chief executive. Paris Ricks, as you've touched on, yes, I, I respect him, the cult by Vers and Get Ricks. He looked good in the paddock on debut and he could only improve off that run and one run can certainly tighten them up. And having a word with Tinny Prinsloo, horse number five, bold premier, the colt by bold Silvano, is also showing some tremendous work at home. So, uh, but for me, I, I'm expecting our horse to win, and, uh, but I am a bit worried about Paris Rex. In Paris Rex's favour, of course, on debut, he was the subject of some betting support from five to one into uh, around 18 to 10. So there was solid support for number six, Paris Rex, on debut. He does have the experience on his side. Of course, as you said, he'll improve leaps and bounds with the experience of that run under his belt. So it's quite possibly a match race. Uh, number six, Paris Rex, who was uh, fourth on debut, well beaten by Edgar, Edgar Town. Edgar Town stable is represented by the first time a number three chief executive. As you heard from Warren, they're expecting this son of Captain of All to go really well.